And now there's something a bit different. The Hall of Fame conditions. What are we going to do? To enter the Hall of Fame and prove you are the best. Be the first GM to earn 10, 10 Hall of Fame trophies. Okay. Trophies can be awarded through either career achievements or seasonal challenges. Okay. Entering the Hall of Fame will allow you to continue playing or retire my retire my save file. That's a very interesting way to do things. I, I like that. Okay, and we're kicking things off. Four weeks till Hell in a Cell. That's a that's a very interesting spot to go with. Four weeks until Hell in a Cell. All right, we got our emails. All right, our first one from a Mr. Triple H. Woods, good to talk to you. Just checking to make sure NXT is ready for the new season. Feeling confident? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I'm feeling confident. Alright. I think we're gonna pick that. I... Yeah, I'm expecting the best possible. Alright. What does Bischoff want? How's it going? Just want to wish you luck for the coming season. We're looking forward to it over at Raw. Oh, Bischoff, Bischoff, Bischoff. Obviously, with the likes of Brock Lesnar on our books, we think we're going to give NXT more than a run for their money. Oh, I'm going to whoop your ass, mate. I promise you that much. Hey Xavier, just want to let you know that I plan on taking SmackDown to the top of the power rankings and staying there. I, I could see that, Kurt. I could see that. But I think we're going to nail this. Alright, now we get the interesting part. We got to select our champions. Alright, so who do we want to be our first champion? I feel like we need someone who could help give this brand that boost. Hmm, I think we are going to go for... Wait, why is LA Knight listed as a babyface? Hmm, I'll fix that later. I think we'll give the belt to someone with experience. Yeah, I think we'll give it to Super Cena. I, I know, I know, may not be the best of choices, but what I could see is having him as our champ is to stabilize the belt. And for the women's title, I think we are going to go with Bailey for the same reason what the hell is this huh new theme yeah I don't know all right there we go Alright, book your least popular available star in a match this week. Okay. That seems interesting. And you got your career progress. Alright, so looking here. Alright, Hell in a Cell, four weeks. We're currently seeing as third, which is very interesting, but right. 
Book my least popular available star for a match this week. Okay, that is a very interesting thing. Alright, I want to see through everything here. Alright. Ooh, they've changed some of this to be available per season. Okay, then. That... That is very different. I picked there. What else we got? We got concert hall, the capital, fleet center, big stadium, and the big open stadium. Okay then. And then we have this section, the free agency. Up. P is there. I am immediately signing him. Good thing I decided to check the free agency. I know that might seem like some is a costly move. It's probably going to be a smart move. Hmm, Solo Sokoa is it. You know what? I think we'll get Soldo as well. Just to help further out our roster. Alright, this is where you get your power cards. And then you've got your season details here. Ooh, surpass 300k in the bank. Sure. Surpass 400k in the bank. Hire on five free agents. And then complete five challenges this season. Okay. I see that. I see that. Alright. Book your least popular available star in a match. Yeah, I think we're gonna pop them in right here. So who is the least popular available? Roxanne? Okay. Alright, let's do Roxanne Perez versus Shotzi. Yeah. I feel like I want to start up the idea of our first big women's feud. So I think we're going to have EO Sky attack Roxanne to kind of begin to establish that side of things. Alright. Confirm. Okay. Let's see, is that the commission logo met? Yes, that is met. Sweet. Okay. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna kick things off by a you know what? I think we're gonna go into our promo section. Alright, how many heals have we got? One, two. Alright, I think we're gonna go into the combat section, pick Finn. So, that's one. Ooh, only four. Four heals. Hmm. I feel like we should increase that, so I'm gonna go roll change. I see Randy Owen being a really good heal, so yeah, definitely set up the roll change. And I see our champ, EO Sky, cutting a promo just to establish her out. Yeah. Yeah, I see that would be a smart idea. And then for the third promo, I feel like we could do a call out. Let's have the champ, John Cena, call out. Called Solo Sokoa. Yeah, I feel like that would. Nah, 
Nah, I feel like... Let's do Soul... Let's do Cody Rhodes. Calling out so Solo. Yeah, build those two up. Alright, and the opening match for my NXT. Oh! Ooh, match. Ooh, you can say it is a multi-man. Alright, I think that's what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna do Fatal 4-Way Normal. I think we're gonna do Johnny Gargano. JD McDonoughan. Austin Theory. And Ilya Dragunov. Yeah. That feels like the perfect kind of match to have there. To open the show. Then I think we're going to do a one-on-one -on -one here. And... Yeah, I think we'll do John Cena versus Solo Sokoa for the main event. Yeah, let's have John Cena in the main event against... LA Knight. Yeah. Yeah, I know Knight is listed as a babyface, but... I don't see that being the case. And right, let's do a tag match here. We're gonna do... Rhea Ripley. We're gonna do Rhea Ripley and Nikki A.S.H. versus Raquel and Indy. Yeah. Yeah, I think we can get away with that. Yeah. I think that's a pretty good card. It... I think that works out nicely, and the show cost isn't that bad. Yeah. Yeah, I see that being a pretty good show. Alright, checking here. Yep. Everything seems good. I don't need to use Finding Champion just yet. Alright, I fulfilled Triple H's goal, so... I think that should be good. Alright. Let's confirm. And I think that... I think we should be good. All right, let's go. All right. I think, I, I'm not into playing the matches in this, so. Simulate. Ooh, Fury got the win. Great way to establish himself there, and. Wow. Gargano and McDonoughan. Okay, that, that would be a great rivalry. Then we have Orden turning heel. I, I feel like it's a good idea to do that. And then Shotzi gets the win. And Eo very much. Not a great promo, but I think that should do pretty well there. Alright. How about this tag match? Okay. Yeah. I did pretty all right. Ooh, and that promo definitely builds up to something there. And then the main event. May not be the best main event, but... Ooh, new rivalry, huh? Interesting. Looks like that's the champ's first rivalry. I like that. All right. How did 2.0 do? Ooh, all ready for the title badge. That, that is very interesting of an idea. The start with the world title match. Yeah, I don't think the show can hold up from that. Hmm. Okay. 
It's all what we need to do, obviously, but... This is some very weird booking here from 2.0, but... It, it takes time to build your brand up. Yep. That is a terrible main event. You, you should have moved your title match. Alright, Raw. What have you got? Hmm, th this is... I'm just so intrigued by watching this. Hmm, Mustafa. I'm trying to see where they put the crypto scam on the card. Hmm. Okay. Volta. Ooh! Definitely a good choice for a women's bout. Yeah. And then Brock was an MVP. MVP wins that. Okay. Alright, what has SmackDown got then? Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll give them about a month with Edge. And then I'll hit them with the cheat code. Yeah. This definitely makes the game a bit longer. Having the four brands. But, you know what? I love it. Yep, there he is. There he is on SmackDown. <laughs> oh man, I see. I s I have some really good ideas coming up. All right, let's see. Ah, good. Edge beat the crypto scammer. Good for you. Oh, that's an old XT logo. I noticed. I think. All right, and looking right here. Ooh. We didn't do as great as everyone else, but there is definitely a lot of work that needs to be done. Okay. Let's take a look at our stats. Okay, I know. I, I played this game last year. All right, so look at our finances. Yeah, yeah, we did pretty well. But let's check the Twitter page here. Real stink of a show. Ooh. Nikki Ash and Rhea Ripley work really well as a tag team. Sai another DQ finish. Lame way for Shotzi to win. Did you guys see Bailey jump rocks in? Oh, it was Bailey. Huh. Didn't really like. Raquel vs. Nikki. Painful to watch Cena vs. Knight. Okay, interesting. Johnny Gargano and JD McDonoughan gave Fury a real run for his money in that. Oh, okay. Opadez Gargano. Not my greatest fight tonight. Have to hand it to Fury for taking full advantage. Yeah. Yeah, of course you got to hand it to Fury there. And I don't know about tonight's NXT. Yeah. We are going to have to turn Night Heel. I, I feel like that's going to be the best I did. How did we do? Uh, I'm curious. How did we do in terms of the rings? Right. There's 2.0. I am so... I can't wait to beat Breeze. That, that is my goal. I, I just want to beat Breeze. If, if I can't beat Raw or SmackDown, I just want to beat Breeze. <laughs> Breeze, you son of a bitch. I'm going to whoop your ass. Alright, then you got SmackDown there. Alright. I successfully accomplished the commissioner goal. And we got ourselves Vito Champ! Ooh, I like that. Alright, how did we do in the ratings? Oh, wow. Wow, we're at the bottom. Hmm. Okay. Not a great start, but... I'm gonna beat you, Braze! I'm gonna beat you! 
All right. Three weeks till Hall in the Cell. Yep. All right. LA Knight versus Cena. Yeah, I, I know. Might not have been the best idea, but I've got a good idea for that. Fury cheated me in that last match. I want a rematch in the next two weeks. Oh, don't you worry. You will get your rematch tonight. It's just... Well, you don't know what to expect. That loser barely attacked me during that last fight. Okay, okay. Just, I've got a few goals I've got to take care of from some of the roster. Yep. Alright. So I promised JD McDonaghan a match with Fury. I promised Roxanne a match with Bailey. Alright, ensure that your least popular available fighter is in a match this week. Okay. Yeah. I think we are immediately gonna go roll change. I think then we're gonna look for LA Knight. And then let's see who who would I like I think we could do Cena versus Fury. Yeah. But we're gonna do interference and let's see. Can I do LA Knight for interference? No, I can't. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. I think what we'll do is our opening is I think our mid card match will be JD McDonaghan versus Austin Fury. And we'll have the interference be. be Gargano. Yeah. Yeah, kind of further their feud a little. Yeah. I think that would be a great idea. Hmm. Yeah, can you actually swap here? Yes, you can. Alright, I want to swap this to be the opener. And then the main event to be... EO versus... No, it wasn't EO, it was... Roxanne versus... Bailey. Yep, there we go. And since these two need to sell the differences, we're going to announce the match to be a one-on-one. -on -one. Um. Yeah, let's make the match a submission. Let's make the match a tables match. Kind of... Add a little bit of excitement to the show. All right. All right, what are we gonna do for the other matches on the card? Um, I think. You know what? I think we can push this to the edge. Set this right away to be a title match. That'll probably boost up our viewers a lot more by having a title bell on the show. Then I think we're going to do a triple threat between Rhea. Indy. And Raquel. Yeah, I could see a triple threat doing really well for the card tonight. And then I think... What do we want to do? 
Yeah, let's do Cody Rhodes versus Solo Sokoa here. Yep. Further a few rivalries. LA Knight doing the role change. And then we'll have John Cena call out LA Knight to kind of be like, Jack, what the hell was that? To kind of build them up for a future match for the belt. Uh, probably Hell in a Cell. And then we're going to do... I think we're going to do a bit of advertising. And I think we're going to do charity. With Ilya. Yeah, I feel like that's a smart idea. Give Ilya the charity spot. Alright. Immediately purchase the venue. Yep, I think that should be good. Yep, getting that concert hall is a good thing. Alright, I think that is going to do really well for us this week. And least popular available fighter. Who would that be then? Is in a match this week. Oh man. Alright, Shotzi's a cruiser. Alright, would Nikki be a fighter then? Okay. Yep. I think that Mike should be able to do it. Yep, there we go! Whew! Okay. I was definitely getting concerned there for a second. Alright, how are we doing in terms of the season goal? Yep. I'm not hiring a free agency yet for the minute. Just trying to establish out the brand. Okay, I think that should make this week's show a lot bigger of a feel. Alright. I think we should be good there, so... Let's go! Alright, let's see how we do... J.D. McDonaghan versus Theory. And we have Gargano running in to further their feud. Yep. And Knight turning heel. Alright, how did this do? Ooh, Raquel. Raquel building up her stock. Yes! Yes, there we go. There we go. That's what we needed to do. And we have Cody and Solo. Cody takes it. Okay. It, it's meant to get the rivalry all built up. Healy establishing himself. And right, the title match. Yeah, Bailey takes the win there. Yeah. I think that was a good thing to get the main event right. Okay. I think we did really well there. I feel like we're going to do really well this week in the rankings. I feel like we're going to do really well there. Shinsuke and AJ! Wow! Oh, you guys introduced your tag belts already? Yeah, no chance at all I'm going to be introducing tag belts for a while. Alright, and your main event. Oh! <laughs> oh, Trift and Damian Priest got the win! Okay, that that is very weird to think about, but... Sure? Alright. Alright, now 
we didn't fit so much. Oh, you guys have introduced the US title. Hmm. Okay. That's interesting how you got the US title all in. Yeah. Okay. And then you got your women's tag title bout. Okay, that's pretty good. Alright, how did SmackDown do? I, I just want to see what they do with the Crypto Scammer. Who has his bootleg Powerade. Oh man, I imagine he'd probably do an ad for his bootleg Powerade. Oh no, he's in a match of Edge! Don't you worry, Edge. I will get you far away from that Crypto Scammer soon enough. Oh god, the Crypto Scammer bet edge why why would you have a crypto scammer beat one of the greatest of all time stupid smackdown oh god i i seriously just want to beat i want to beat breeze that that is my goal i want to whip breeze's ass in the book and it's gonna take me ages but it's gonna be so worth it Okay. How did we do here? Okay, we're definitely getting up there. My mid card outperformed the opener. Well, yeah, obviously. The opener was more or less an angle to establish stuff. Alright, well, how did we do? Match between Fury and McDonaghan added in a DQ thanks to Gargano messing things up. Yes, obviously. Fury wins by DQ against JD McDonaghan. Thanks to a run from Gargano. That's because we have to further that feud. Gargano just came out and attacked JD McDonaghan. Yes. That's going to leave a mark. Rhodes has to be itching for another match against Sokoa. Oh, yes. And what do we got here? Raquel gets payback on Rhea. Oh, hell yeah. Ooh, LA Knight here. Yeah. Keep running your mouth while you can, John Cena. It's gonna be wide shut for a while after next week. Ooh, next week. Yeah, I think, yeah, that's gonna be a good idea there. Had a good day in the ring against Solo Sokoa. That's the kind of dominance I'm going to bring to NXT. Damn straight, Cody! Ooh, Gargano. Hardly surprised that JD and lost to Fury. Well, yes. <laughs> no one can accuse NXT of repetitive matches this week. They mixed it up a lot. Well, yes. Desperate for attention, Johnny Gargano. I'll give you what you deserve soon enough. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We are building that up. We are building that up, guys. Gargano and McDonaghan. That's going to be a great mid-card feud there. All right. Got 2.0 there. With all of its stats, blah, blah, blah. I... I don't really pay attention to the other brands. All I pay attention to when it comes to the other brand stats is when it comes to the ratings and the money. That's all I want to know. I want to know how they're doing. And jeez, SmackDown made a lot of money. All right, we did really well there. Special promotion. Ooh. All right, how do we do? We're still fourth. But we're going to get there. Gonna get there. We just gotta beat SmackDown. And then Raw. And then beat Breeze. <sighs> I'm gonna beat you, Breeze. I promise you that much.